Okay, I think we're up to about video 12 now. And this one here is the cost of inflation. There are three costs of inflation, causes of inflation. Right, causes, not cost, causes of inflation. Okay, demand pull, positive output gap, demand pull inflation, you can draw this diagram or the positive output diagram. Too much demand, chasing too few goods, really, really easy. Cost push inflation, really easy diagram again, easy to explain, rise in the oil and gas prices, therefore cost push inflation. Uh, demand pull inflation obviously caused by interest rates being being too low or the government spending too much money. And the third one on here is MV equals PT. And this is to do with the belief from the Montrist that if the money supply goes up, then this will create inflation because there is a direct link between the money supply and inflation. V and T are always stable. So if we look at this diagram on here, we can explain this because we can say, OK, so the government might want to decrease unemployment, so therefore it increases the money supply. When it does that, it increases demand to here. Clearly, national income goes up from NY to NY dash. When NY moves to NY dash, this means that uh, this means that when we get a high level of real national income, that there'll be lower unemployment, fewer people in the jobs market. They therefore they will ask for more money. They then ask for more money, and this increases the SRAS to SRAS to SRAS dash, and this is of course the price level. Okay. So these are the causes of inflation. Thank you.